So boxer, you listen to me. Your head's up, your punches up, move. Manasev, Box. that ended in a technical knockout. Let's hope there's no dramas here. Conlon settles down to business. Agnadali knows what he's going to do. He's going to put him under pressure, give Conlon no rest, no break at all. He just took Punches a right hook, and again, he's going to be careful of that, the Irishman. Good body shot there. I was just wondering why he was decided to stand and fight the fighter, but landed some great body shots. He needs to move his feet, though, because that's what he's good at and what we expected, and that's what he may be doing. The Uzbekistans may have expected one thing and he's doing another. Good finish from Conlon. Watch your head, hands up, boxer. To take a few punches in this round, though. I'm not sure how they're going to score this one on the cards. Close first round. Just there was a lovely light left hand there from Conlon in the southpaw stance. He's working well from that southpaw stance. He's thrown that right up to the body really well, and that'll be taking its toll. Now he gets his punches off and out of range. One of the keys we've seen from the Zuzbek squad is so many of them are aggressive power punches as well. And it's great to see because, in a way, he's bullying the bully. Excellent point. Commonwealth champion, European champion. Less than a minute oh, to go. Oh, oh, oh. No. Big right hand from Akhmedali of Conlon down, and in the second successive bout, we've had a fighter and a boxer in front on the scorecards, in command, hit the deck, and late drama. Well, Shared about Akhmedali of power. Conlon only had to post and skip his way round the ring and stay out of range and he just walked onto that right hook. Oh, that was with about 40 seconds to go. We're inside the final 10. Just move his feet. There goes the bell. The winner on points in 2015, 56 kilogram bantamweight world champion from the blue corner representing Ireland, Micah. Conlon it is who wins gold.